Give us a call. We have a ton of voicemails this week. Leave a voicemail. Questions are preferred. And uh, at the end of the week, if you give us a five-star review on iTunes, uh, we will read it verbatim hmm. as long as it's not racist. Uh, but you can shit on us and we'll read it still. So let's get yeah. voicemails. Bubba, can you please play the first voicemail? Of Hard Factor Boys, this is Luis from California. Um, I was just listening to the Wednesday uh, stereo happy hour with uh, Pat Cassidy and Hard Factor Wes. Um, Pat, love how you say Puerto Rico. I was wondering if you could say a quick Puerto Rico when you hear this. Uh, and also, I wanted to see if you can help me with this also, Pat. Um, I wanted to do some online gambling, and I signed up to this one uh, MGM website. Uh, they have a sign-on bonus that they'll match uh, 100% of the whatever you deposit. Um, I went ahead and deposited $100, and somehow I have $225 in balance. They're ready to spend and ready to use, but I am not a resident of uh, New Jersey. So unfortunately, I didn't read that, and I cannot gamble that money. We can work out a way where I'll send you the credentials, and we can put it all on black or do whatever. Um, but yeah. That is it. Uh, I love the podcast. Listen to you guys every morning. And uh, thank you so much for what you guys do. Keep them coming. Nice. Puerto Rico. Uh, dude, <laughs> gladly. Yeah. Send, me, send me your betting login credentials. And uh, yeah, we'll put it all on black. Uh, can, we, uh, can we get it on that too? Yeah, can we get it on that too? Uh, it sounds like it's a New Jersey resident thing. Right. So uh, Bovada, that's what I use. I actually signed up for the Barstool Sports Book app when I moved to New Jersey because I was like, oh, this is, has to work. It doesn't work. Uh, so you might be running that same thing with MGM. Bovada has always had the, the like the most lax, absolute lax laws ever. So like on your phone, you'll try to log in and it'll be like, we don't offer service there in New Jersey. And then you try again. And it's like, oh, wait, a, we just did. Uh, oh, just yeah. you, you call their customer service and deal with them in Bovada. It's oh. a bunch of Olga cam bots that are like, you know, like indentured servants over there. They're like, it, it's pretty pretty loose over there in Bovada. Yeah. And I've never taken a payout in the 12 years I've been there, but apparently they do pay. Out, so. It works. It works. All right. Let's play the next one. <laughs> Oh my god! Fucking leg cramped up. <laughs> hey, I, I lost your head. Uh, I just had a bar stool, to be honest. I'm um, kind of growing out of the bar stool phase here. But listen to your latest show released today, and I heard Pat groan when you uh, when you said Mark. Uh, there was only one voicemail, so want to call in, tell you guys, you guys are doing it. <clears throat> I'm watching your show daily. Love it. Uh, I'd love to hear more about what you guys plan to do in the future. Let's get you big. You guys are great. Uh, not to pump you up too much, you know? Yeah. Uh, I'd love to see all four of you on the show at one time. That's what we got so far. Uh, Bubba, keep up law school. I don't know what happened to the other interns. Keep it up though as well. Uh, keep it going, boys. Love it. Nice. Yeah, awesome. Awesome voicemail. Thank nice. you. Nice. Wes was having a severe leg cramp off screen. Did you see that? Yeah, you were. God damn! Wow. Wes was it, there must have been there must have been a ghost in the chat because like uh, I my headphones disconnected too. Yeah, I Crazy. thought I, we said something that offended Wes. He looked like he was about to quit the show. <laughs> my calf <laughs> muscle just seized up. Wow! <laughs> I went on a walk for the first time. Today Eat a banana, a long bro. Time. Well, it's uh, been a tough, tough day. <laughs> well, next that walk <laughs> next for Wes is potassium. Uh, right. And then God. and then we're gonna do some what metal detecting and then we'll make a we'll make a movie in a couple of years, right? I don't know. What? Yeah. Uh, that's oh, yeah. I think that is the ultimate be, goal. Yes. Movie would be incredible. Yeah. And then I think like uh, in the short term, like we're building, we want to build this hard factor business and make it uh, so that it is big and it is doing well. Uh, and then so we we're working on getting, you know, our our setup going, more interviews going in the future, week coming weeks and stuff and. Uh, because we, we want to grow this and then eventually just parlay it into more stuff, I think. Would prefer to have the number one new show in, in America, even though it's explicit. That's the goal. Pat, what do you what do you think? Yeah, no, I think those are awesome. Make a movie one day. Make a TV show. Mm -hmm. uh, just keep doing it, man. Keep mm. doing it. What do you think, Bubba? Bubba? Well, I was going to say, I also appreciate the well wishes to finish up law school. But I finished up law school seven months ago and I just took the bar. But thank you very much. And I, I appreciate everything that any... Had to come on and be a dick. Me. You had yeah. to come on and be a dick. Uh, it's yeah. <laughs> raining on that guy's parade. <laughs> well, fuck that guy, I guess, right? <laughs> <laughs> nah, we really appreciate it. that. Was great. Thank you so much. Yes, thank you. 
And we're, we're excited it. to keep doing the show. I mean, we want to get big too. So let's let's yeah. work on it together. Every first chance. Step, tell first a step. First step. Tell a friend, and also uh, send us the idea for what the trending thing at the top is going to be called. So Pat has a. That's very true. Yeah. Yeah. Um, all right. Let's play the next one, Bubba. If if you don't mind. <laughs> Hey there, fellas. Colt from Iowa again. Uh, just addressing uh, what what's his name? Fucking Topher that left that shitty review. Uh, hey, guy, this is like the only place where you can get fun news anymore. Angry white guys. These, these guys, every single day they're laughing and cracking jokes around. That's why we all love them. Uh, super go fuck yourself, dude. Go play fucking <laughs> off or something. I, I don't know where to fucking get off like that. I, whatever, I, you know, boys, I got your back. Don't put up with shit like that. Don't even bother reading it. You guys are doing great. You're killing it. Have a great fucking day. Hope we go fuck <laughs> That's amazing. Hell That's yeah, Colt. Voicemail. Super go fuck yourself, dude. Yeah. He I'll also lacrosse. Yeah. crushed him with the cr- <laughs> lacrosse line. Topher <laughs> is such a lacrosse name. That was the yeah. five-star review where he said, we're not having fun anymore. We're an angry yeah. white podcast. Oh, yeah. yeah, just uh, yeah. just to draw a quick uh, parody here, hmm. that would be like if I went by trick. <laughs> Hey boys, trick That's here. A great point, Christopher. <laughs> yeah. mm-hmm. Trick. What's up? Yeah. Tricks in the house. Uh, uh, <laughs> you might Dad. develop you might develop some opinions. Yeah, you and Topher would be on the same lacrosse team for sure. Dad, can I go out with trick tonight? <laughs> no. <Absolutely not>. Yeah. <laughs> Teach you a couple things. All right, next one, Bubba. Hey, what's up? My name's Dom uh, from California, and I was to the show on Thursday. I think it was like the 11th, um, and it was Wes's dark story uh, from Anaheim about the weekend at Bernie's murder. Uh, and my dad actually works for Anaheim PD, and he was like, you know, working on the case. And uh, I called him, and I was like talking about how you guys brought it up. And I just mentioned the name Willie Wallace, and he's like, "Oh, we need that Bernie's," and I thought it was the funniest fucking shit ever. Um, just keep it up the work. Uh, great fucking show. I uh, love you guys. That's awesome. Yeah, for those of you who missed that show, that guy killed his wife and then propped her up like Bernie while the kids opened presents on it Christmas Day. Psycho. Did Real he psycho said shit. the local the local <laughs> police force <laughs> called him <laughs> Bernie? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so we yeah, Wes, you nailed it. You labeled that Christmas at Bernie's was yeah. the title yeah. of the of uh, so the local PD doing yes. the same. Well, tell your dad to tell him him and the boys to t- t- check out Hard Factor. It seems like we uh, would get along. Can yeah. you shit on that guy for real though? Because I mean, like he already did what he did. She's dead. You might as well. What do have you mean? Can s- you shit on him? I'm just saying. Sh- w- would you prefer them to have Christmas morning when they know their mom's dead, or have a blissful oh. Christmas morning oh, when they think are you mom d- is dead? Anything, anything without the dead body in the, in the are room? Are you defending this guy? It's going to be you can't way unkill her. Pat, right, it's going to be you also don't have to parade her long, carcass long, around. Long term, it's way worse. That they saw her that christmas all morning yeah. over the they present. hugged her they took what? pictures with her the smell like, had had they not seen her at all and just he canceled christmas it would have probably recovered a little quicker than seeing her dead body and not a, realizing it a thousand times quicker yeah those pictures are keepsakes all right uh, okay. bubba, bubba let's play the next one <laughs> it's last christmas with mommy are those etfs <laughs> or uh, efts mm-hmm. nfts <laughs> what's up boys my name is matt p uh, looking for some advice from you guys. You guys all do good with the ladies. Pat, I don't really understand how you're able to bag Kate. But just a little about me. I'm a bridge designer. Let's say that I am worried about that new tax increase, if you know what I mean. <laughs> uh, above average in height, above average below the belt. Also, uh, very humble. Um, big, humble guy. Also, a patriot <laughs> fan, really like golf. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, if you guys could give me some advice on the ladies kind of struggling a little bit, and I know you guys do pretty well. So, thanks, guys. Mm. Block tro- the door. Is he trolling <laughs> us? The Cuomo? Yeah, block the door. No, I think he's. we're, we're noted sex havers. I mean, we do have sex. That's for yeah. sure. <clears throat> Since little all trolling. Of us, all of us have sex. It, enough of it to have at least some kids so. yeah i i think you you find your target you obtain your target and um you know everyone makes a mistake once in a while so lo- hopefully your lady will make a mistake the one that you want and you can get her pregnant and she's right. stuck with you forever that's a good point i that's also a great point would, would get say her drunk and, and then 
pretend like you're wearing a condom and then get her pregnant. Yep. Consensually. No, we don't. That could work. Well, consensually, the, the sex, but then, you know, trick her about the condom part, potentially. That's really only you don't if have you want disease, it. disease because then you can get her. Look, that's really only if you want to keep her around like forever, forever. You want, yeah. 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 And right. then yeah. the bridge builder didn't tell us what he was looking for. Well, it depends on what he, I'd say. Keep it fun. I like I like the drink, the drunk part there, because like, I mean, I don't know. Everything's fun. If you if you, if anything is not fun in the first like few months of dating, it's just going to fucking end. I so think- you got to make if, if you're not having the most fun you're ever having and you're single. First of all, if you're single, you got to be having the most fun you're ever having. And then having the most fun you're ever having is going to get you the fun <laughs> that's going to bring the lady in. Well, take her going to have it. On a on a first date, take her to a bridge you built. And that's like, you know. And then, oh. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Wow, yeah. that's a good point. If yeah, you and, could, then, and then pull off to the side and like do like a picnic and looking at the stars, and you're just gonna bang. If her you the could grass. end like yeah. the, the a most fun date at yeah. your own bridge, I mean, you could probably pop the question right yeah. there. You could probably and get a marriage. Yes, her take her to the bridge. the bridge. We'll be falling down if you know what I mean. Mm-hmm. She's gonna have to pay the troll toll. <laughs> Um, just look yourself in the mirror every morning and tell yourself that you're the fucking best and no one's better than you. And uh, even though it's a lie, it'll carry you through the day to meet a lady. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Let's positive put, affirmations. Yeah. You got to just lie to yourself. Meditation. Uh, mm-hmm. right, you know, look yourself in the eye and lie. Bubba. Can you Last play the voicemail. One? I don't think you have hey, an actual. Boys, b- me, b- Joe, b- California. Love how everything's going, you know, with your own thing. Appreciate it. Here's my, uh, oh, let's call it a challenge for charity. Million dollars to the winner or loser, how you think of it. You got all four of you. You take a blue chew and you start whacking off. Last one to whack off onto like the cracker, you got to eat it. Maybe that guy gets the million dollars. I don't know if it's worth it. Strategy. Are you going to try to fuck with the other guys, make their concentration? Like, you know, I can't finish. Or, are you just going to fucking ferociously start masturbating, doing your own thing, trying to walk in? All right, boys. Love you guys. Have a good one. Whoa. Wait. Interesting. So we have to presume that the person who eats the cracker does get the million, right? You followed that? No. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I followed it but loosely. I mean, he said. I can't stop thinking about eating a cracker with a cum on it. <laughs> he says that everybody takes a blue chew. It's an ookie cookie on a saltine, basically. And then, <laughs> and then he says. And then he says. Look, is is the person the person who eats it gets a million, or they Would, might not? What are you gonna do? What if what's another option to get a million? I think he's implying he doesn't have the million to give that. Person. No, I he I think he's saying yeah. uh, it's a win or lose depending on how much we love each other. I think that's what he's trying to say. Like either the loser eats the cookie or the winner eats the cookie. That's what he was saying. I think. What? No, I think he's saying the first one to come gets the money, and the last no, one no, to no, come no, has no, to no, eat no, the cookie. No, no. No, definitely play it not. again, Bubba. Play definitely it again. not. Do not play it again. <laughs> Dude, from what I from what I gathered from it, it was the guy who eats the ookie cookie gets, gets the, a million. Gets the million. Maybe. That's what I'm saying. Well, not, so he's maybe. saying. Maybe. So, what he's, what, so what's the other option? If the person that saying, doesn't eat the cookie doesn't get it, then who who does? Right. Are you, are you going to jack off and try to finish? Or you're just going to eat the cookie, basically. Yeah, it's, it's if you it's if you want the million or if you'd rather eat jizz. Can you play it again, please? Just so we're clear. It's basically, would you rather? A million dollars or play not eat jizz. Play one more time. Play one more time. Let's hear it again. Hang on, we're gonna we're gonna get it up here. We're gonna get it going. <laughs> it's not hypothesize with, about this with, cum cookie and no, any longer. <laughs> <laughs> hey boys, me Joe, California. Love how everything's going. You know, with your own thing. Appreciate it. Here's my uh, oh, it's called a challenge for charity. Million dollars to the winner <laughs> or lose most of it. You got all four of you. You take a blue chew and you start whacking off. Last one to whack off onto like the cracker, you gotta eat it. Maybe that guy gets the million dollars. I don't know if it's worth it. Strategy. Are you gonna try to fuck with the other guys, make their concentration? So like, you know, I can't finish. Or are you just gonna fucking ferociously start masturbating, doing your own thing, trying to walk in? All right, boys. Love you guys. Have a good one. What the fuck? Okay, I get it now. You would never enter a game of this high of stakes with with uh, Joe from California being the game master. Is what I think I'm learning. <laughs> yeah, his rules are very unclear. 
But <laughs> you no, you're, I think, sure. Will, you were right. Well, I, mean, I think you're right. It's, it's, it's either it's either it's either yeah. you definitely don't want to be the last guy to jerk off uh, to finish jerking off. But that guy still might get a million dollars. So you have to decide. Right. Whether Where or not, is the million bucks? What are you talking about? The million dollars is, is, is someone gets the fucking million dollars. But the but the, the guy who eats the cookie definitely has to so, eat. So the there's coma. four guys. One. Right. One and that guy, and, and the, the guy who finishes first. last might get it, or the guy How who finishes hydrated first. Are we? Yeah, yeah, exactly. There's four, <laughs> oh, wait, hang on. There's four guys, <laughs> and we're all jerking off, right? Right. Yeah. <laughs> So one we of gotta us, take a blue chew. One of us off. gets the million. We all take a blue chew. My mom <laughs> left the radio, went to the bathroom a long time ago. You also have to finish. It could be anyone. Why would you eat the cookie? You have to finish to be eligible in these rules. That right. sounds like a he didn't. To be he didn't make that thing. clear. You, well, no, well, but clearly because he was like furiously masturbate or break concentration. I would absolutely. I mean, if if everyone's eligible, I would absolutely not eat the cookie. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, the last guy to finish, has, to finish, finish, to finish <laughs> has to eat it. He didn't say. He didn't say so, that. Yeah, he did. Yeah, that's last guy to finish. Okay, okay, has to eat okay, the okay, okay. To, I'm, to, I'm feverishly jerking. To get all your right. To get all y'all's you know, answers. <laughs> I'm stop it. <laughs> to get all y'all's answers, it's last one to not has to eat. That eater okay. gets a million dollars. Would you rather get the million dollars and eat the cum, or would you rather finish first and not have to eat it? That's it. it that's doesn't, that's doesn't pretty much what it bothers me. A million to. bucks, probably. I mean, it's would you rather not eat cum for a million dollars? For would you rather not eat cum or eat cum? Million a million dollars? A million I would, dollars? I wouldn't I don't eat. Think one, he asked the question right. I wouldn't eat one of your guys' cum because that wouldn't be worth it. But if it was potentially a million stranded. dollars, yeah. you would eat my cum. I'd no. be eating pineapple all week. It'd be he delightful. Said for, he said it's for charity though. So if it's for charity, oh, I'm trying. We're giving the money first. away. No, I'm definitely not doing that then. If it's for charity, I'm finishing. First. I'd explain to the charity what I went through. <laughs> yeah, they, right, we'd, never, we'd never talk to each bit. other after this again. <laughs> I'm going to keep some of this money, charity. Because like, here's well, why. Here's the thing. If it's for charity, then <laughs> as long as everybody comes, they get the million bucks. But if it's it, but it, yeah. So but if it's personal, then people are going to probably like not come. There'll be there'll be different situations going on. So you know what? call back call back next week, sir, and explain the rest of the rules. Yeah, we gotta get a little bit of a clarification there. <laughs> we got a few questions for you. Um oh, is that the last one, Pat? Yeah guys, that's gonna do over hard factor. Thank you so much for listening. Uh leave us voicemail, give us a review. Hey, most importantly, tell a friend. We're in a real growth phase right now. Things are going well. We're feeling the mo. So uh spread the word about hard factor. That's where you can get your news, you know, from some barely informed dudes. But we're going to give it to you straight. Have a great fucking day.